Here in the studio to talk to us more about ADA and the benefits of having beef as part of a healthy diet is Michelle Peterson Murray, Executive Director of Food and Nutrition Communication for the National Cattlemen's Beef Association. Thanks so much for coming to the show. Absolutely. Thank you. You know, the American Dietetics Association uh, recent conference is the largest of its kind. And, and tell us just a little bit about the beef checkoff's presence at that conference. Well, absolutely. The Beef Checkoff has actually been a long-standing supporter of the American Dietetic Association's conference. It brings together more than 8,000 registered dietitians, industry leaders, nutrition scientists from around the country. And this year's exhibit, we featured a Name That Lean Beef um, cut quiz, which allowed uh, registered dietitians to get to know the great lean beef cuts that beef has to offer, like tenderloin and T-bone, and also find out more about the fact that those cuts are also America's favorite cuts of beef. Um, we also had several farmers and ranchers at the booth to interact with registered dietitians because we know that those health professionals are getting questions about how food is produced. And so the farmers and ranchers we had at the booth were able to talk to them about the questions that they're getting and give them a real picture of what really takes place on farms and ranches around the country. You know, Michelle, I've heard that there's an increased interest among these health and nutrition professionals for learning a little bit more about cooking techniques and even recipes. Uh, what, what is the Beef Checkoff doing in that regard? Well, every year registered dietitians look to the Beef Checkoff booth for great tasting, good for you um, items. Mm -hmm. And so we sampled several different recipes and this year we featured a um, great new beef for breakfast item called um, a sweet potato beefy hash. And it was one of six different recipes that really highlight the importance of beef at a unique meal occasion, breakfast. Um, and the importance of getting protein through the day was one of the key points that we were able to deliver through the recipe tasting as well as a cooking demonstration that was led by our executive chef. Um, we also launched beefnutrition.org and that was a relaunch of a website that has been um, you know, available to health professionals from, for quite some time, but we refreshed that site and made it much more useful to them. We've actually seen an increase in site traffic by more than 50% um, since the conference took place. Well, certainly nutrition is an important uh, issue for, for all Americans, and this is a critically important conference. How does this conference help us get our message across to those critically important influencers? Well, really through two things, um, through educational opportunities, so us providing fact sheets, recipes, nutritional information to health professionals, um, the resources that they'll go back and use, um, as well as relationship building with folks that are message multipliers. These are the kinds of folks who are cookbook authors, they're spokespeople, they're journalists, they're individuals that are getting the message out to consumers and they help shape the opinion of consumers around the areas of nutrition and health. Um, so it's a really critical audience for the Beef Checkoff and what we're able to do there is provide that visibility for beef and help contribute and, and help shape that opinion around why beef really does belong in a healthy diet and what it does to contribute um, great nutrients to Americans. I know uh, your team is constantly working on a lot of things in the nutrition area. Give us a sneak preview of uh, what's to come out of your area. Sure. Well, one of the major aspects of communications that we're working on right now is translating the dietary guidelines for Americans. Mm. The report just came out in January, and there's a lot of information there. And so we want to get the facts out around red meat, beef specifically, mm -hmm. um, and what it can do to help um, with Americans' diets. Mm -hmm. We're also working on something called Team Beef with many of our state beef councils around the country. Uh, states are sponsoring race teams and running teams mm -hmm. um, that really helps emphasize that message around beef and what it does to fuel physical activity, mm -hmm. how it helps you maintain your weight um, and build muscle. Mm -hmm. And so those are some of the two key points that we're working on right now. Um, and you can look at a lot of the resources that we make available through the Beef Checkoff on our primary consumer website, beefitswhatsfornitter.com, as well as the website that I mentioned earlier, beefnutrition.org, and that site is specifically um, designed for health professionals. That's great. Well, thank you so much for coming today, and more importantly, thanks for all you're doing to uh, get across the, the great nutritional message that our beef product has to, to share with Americans. Absolutely, thank you. For more information on the ADA or beef nutrition, visit our website at cattlemantocattlemen.org.